If it's one way to get support from a good amount of black people, it's going to jail. When are you guys going to learn? The more you indict, the more we unite. It's Trump 2024. As black people, you know, we f with Trump. Yeah, I f with Trump. I don't know what everybody got against him. I'm going to be honest with you. I f with Trump. I'm with Trump. We making sure they get their bread. I ain't going to lie. You want to know why I'm here to support President Trump? Because they done did black men like this for decades. Yeah, so Trump is back on board in the black community. And really the only thing that will make black people turn their back on him at this point is if he snitches on somebody. <laughs> I saw clean through him and Kamala with my own damn two eyeballs. But you know what happens when people been conditioned to serve that beast? They gonna keep serving the beast. They gonna keep on praising the master. That's why it's so hard to wake people up to the damn truth. A couple years ago, I said that these two gonna f up the country. They make the worst team in political history. Since that George Floyd march, I've been waking up to the truth, trying to get my brothers and sisters to join me. But no, anytime you fall in the Democrat party, you're always gonna vote for skin and gender because that's all they run for. That's their rhetoric. And that's exactly why they voted for that woman. That's the only reason why Biden won because a lot of people voted for her thinking that she was gonna make a difference. <laughs> oh, she's the first black woman. No, she not black. Whoever said this is 100% correct. Be careful how you treat people. What you do to others has a funny way of coming back to you. Well, I think the Biden administration is experiencing that right now as we speak. In this video, we're going to listen to a number of black people supporting Trump. I don't think the Biden administration saw this one coming. I did. But um, I guess they have to learn the hard way. After this dude, I don't even like Trump. I ain't vote for him. But I tell you what, I probably will next time because this dude seems to be turning black. The more he does, the more blacker he seems to get because they keep going after this dude for nothing. Sound just like they what they've been doing to black people for years. Mm. I'm going to tell you right now, if America ain't waking up and seeing the game that's going on, y'all ain't never going to get it. I mean, they've been after this man for everything under the sun. The more they go after this dude, I don't even like Trump. I ain't vote for him. But I tell you what, I probably will next time because this dude seems to be turning black. The more he does, the more blacker he seems to get. Cause they I love black people. I love black people. Yeah, I guess from their perspective, what it means to be black is to get locked up and to have a mugshot. <laughs> wow, I have a long way to go. The left knows exactly how to bait black people because they use things like racism. The other day, Michelle Obama went on TV. She gave a whole speech, talked about how Trump was this and Trump was that. And at the very end of what she said, she made sure to say, and yes, it is racist. You know why? Because the minute you call anything racist or you add race into it, black people get emotional and they come out. Kamala did the same thing because they know how to bait black people in. Here's my thing, and I've told black people this before, who are Democrat. I don't try to convince Democrats to be Republican, but I try to convince them to do is know your history and read a little bit. Do your research. You, If you still want to vote Democrat, do what you do, but be an educated and an informed voter. Most Democrats can't tell you why they're Democrats. They just hate Donald Trump. They can't even tell you what Biden did in 47 years, but they're going to vote for him. They can't tell you what Kamala did while she was in California, locking black people up left and right, but they're going to vote for him. When will the slaves get off the plantation? You know what happens when slaves get off that plantation? The house is tell on. He's on point. He is so on point. I was on Facebook just the other day and this person sent me this message. Uh, let me see if I could uh, blow it up for you. I'm going to have to cover the side here so you guys don't see their, their identity and so on. But here is the thing. He said, why? Why give your soul to the devil, Trump? He will spit you. He will spit on a minority in a heartbeat. I answer him by saying, my friend, you have the wrong idea of who the devil is. Could you give three examples how Trump is the devil and what exactly he has done for you to say that about an individual? Secondly, how has he in the past done evil to minority class? And then I will answer your question. Black voters don't count. Deep inner city. Uh, that, that was it. And and, and I, let, I, I put some more facts underneath and I realized I, I was facing somebody who with uh, Trump derangement syndrome. Donald J. Trump is now president of the United States. President Obama. Oh. Mr. Trump. 
Can I ask you a quick question? Yeah. So you are obviously a person of color like we are. Yeah. And we're supposed to not be Trump supporters. So what I'm is it about Trump you that... You know what? I'm going to tell you something right now. I was talking to my husband about it earlier. And when I really started educating myself and informing myself mm. on Donald Trump, one thing that I'm passionate about is human trafficking, that especially of children. Yep. And when I really started digging into it, I saw that Trump also is a huge supporter. He donated recently $35 million dollars to support uh, uh, human traffic survivors, yep. that really um, struck a chord with my heart. And so Amazing. when I started really looking into him, I started, I'm about action, I'm not about words, mm -hmm. okay? Yes, I like the fact that he says what's on his mind. I like the fact that he doesn't say what he thinks people want to hear from him. And to me, I know everything that he's done for the black communities, and I stand behind him Beautiful. 100%. I'm not only a, a Trump supporter, I am a Trump lover. And mm -hmm. for the longest time, I've been afraid to come out and say that. Well, here we because go. I didn't want to lose. That is one beautiful woman with a lot of common sense. As black people, you know, we f with Trump. Yeah, I f with Trump. I don't know why everybody got against him. Yo, he was making f the breadwinners, you heard? I'm a Democrat too, but f it, we Trump. We need Trump back in office right now. I'm gonna be honest with you. I f with Trump. To be honest with you, bro, for real, Trump really did this shit. And I like him because he's about money. It wasn't about no politics. He wanted to make America great again. Through Trump. That boy Trump be making sure to get they bread. I ain't gonna lie. I'm thinking Trump for life. Trump for life. <laughs> for I ain't gonna lie. Blood on the Trump. Trump wanted us to get off our ass and get some money. Trump 2024. It's true. You mean everybody hold a piece of money. Mm -hmm. Trump really up balls. So Trump running it how it's supposed to be ran. And people just can't take it. And he putting out facts in front of the people. He ain't lying to the people. Mm -hmm. People just don't want to accept the truth. Trump, man, we rocking with you. Love you, Trump. My dog. What's up? Trump put the money in our pocket. Trump had the country on a better path as far as economically. He put America first, so it makes sense. I like someone who's like to play as people first. Trump 2024, my brother. I you know they can't get him for none of the real shit. We get it, gang. Yeah. I ain't used to like that. But now, bro, I realize that he meant well for the country and shit, bro. We need that back. Free Trump. Trump 2024. They all tricked y'all dumbass to get Trump out the chair, and now look how that shit I'm backfired on y'all dumbass. Mm. Trump got my back. Trump for life. Down Trump. He showed his love. He showed his love. And he didn't stop. 2024 Trump. Trump. 2024. From Baltimore. I ain't gonna lie. Trump, my mother. No. Imagine they talk shit about Trump. He's probably the best thing for America right now. No cap. Really. Trump. My man Trump. He's gangster. I like him. I love him. Make America great again. Let's go. Trump 2024. Trump 2028. Trump 2032. Man, listen. Trump for life. If you have a problem figuring out whether you're for me or Trump, and you ain't black. And you ain't black. Oh, really? That's what he said. That's what he said. What an idiot. This is the word out there, friends. It's just that the people are speaking. They are sympathizing with Trump. They realize, man, what's being done to the man is not exactly correct. You know, Trump himself promoted, by the way, his own merch. And I love it. Let me get the video for you. Is there anyone on the planet that doesn't know what I look like? I wish there were some people like that. That'd be very nice for me. And yet, for some reason, the communist Democrats in Atlanta made a mugshot of me. That's a mugshot because I said the election was rigged. And I believe it more strongly than ever. It was a rigged election. We all know why, and we know what they're doing, and we certainly get it. But I know I'm your favorite president, and they make me look like a criminal, but it completely and Totally backfired, as you probably read. Since my mugshot was released, our campaign has raised over $10 million. The people get it. The people know this is a sham and a scam. This is nothing but election interference. They want to interfere with our election so they can try and damage me with all these bullshit lawsuits that you see flying all over the place. But it's election interference. It's orchestrated by crooked Joe Biden, the worst president in the history of our country along with the deep state. And on November 5th, 2024, it's going to backfire again when we win back the White House and make America great again. I just want to thank you for your tremendous support. And here it is. If you want to go out and get it, you can go out and get it. Have fun with it. <laughs> but people do like it, I must say. Thank you very much. <laughs> I love it. I'm here to support President Trump. You want to know why I'm here to support President Trump? Because they done did black men like this for decades. Make up charges and put on so I know Trump is innocent. I support Trump against this corrupt, two-tiered justice system. 
That's why I'm here to show my support as a black man for Trump. And I'm wearing my shirt, Trump 2024, and I mean that. What do you think about the indictments? Oh, it's a bunch of <laughs> It's going around the country. You know, Fanny, Fanny Willis, she's a, uh, she went to school with my sister. She's full of shit. She was full of shit then. So she's a puppet for the white liberal that, that is controlling everything. She's in front, but the white liberal back there pulling those strings, telling her what to do. That's what I think about her, making a fool of herself. Do you think it's going to help his election? Oh, of course it is. It's going to elevate him all the way. I think we should make Trump king. That's how I feel. <laughs> we should make him be, king. Um, wouldn't that be like, make Trump like king. communistic? <laughs> no, nah, there's no way nothing near communist. Now, nah, we're just going to make him king, but we still got our freedoms and rights and everything. He fought that. Yeah, Trump oh, for king, man. 2024. <laughs> oh, my Lord. I can't. I can't. Y'all black people are tripping. <laughs> Even Candace Owen loves the new song, by the way, guys. <laughs> okay, okay. And as if that wasn't great enough, he gets booked, his mugshot is released, and now, of course, there's, there's, there's rap songs being made about him. Take a listen. Orange man bad, the whole world mad, thug life, shout out all of my MAGA base chats, coming for the deep state, I will stop the new world order, but before that I'll finish walls at the border. Orange man bad, the whole world mad. <laughs> this is just absolutely genius. I am not who they are after, I'm just in the way they want to get to you, but I won't let them Wait, 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 he's cooking. He's actually cooking. She's but these rappers riding with me, then my soldiers. Mega, 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 I am not who they are after, I'm just in the way they want to get to you, but I won't let them. Mega, 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 I am not who they are after, I'm just in the way they want to get to you, but I won't let them. Cold hearted, no, I'm artist, getting back to where I started. I don't need to do the race, I'ma beat them Rico charges. Hey. And if I go. That's right. I don't need to do it. I'm not going to lie to you. Beat I'm them. not going to lie to you. Since we went over and we changed our party and we and we supporters of Trump, I ain't going to lie to you. I don't know about you, but I see how liberated Kanye felt when he switched his party and it became national. Yeah. I see how he felt. It felt like free. So sad that. We'll stop the new world order. But before that, I'll finish Wells at the border. YSL, slash, slash, shout out Thugger. Finny got nothing on us. Prison, you can't do me like the Clintons. I'll be laid up, eating steak with Secret Service, chilling, screaming, <laughs> orange man bad, the whole world mad, thug life, shout out all of my MAGA base chats, mm -hmm. coming for the deep state. Oh man, the MAGA base has been mobilized, galvanized, awakened, energized in ways I have never, never seen before. Bro, that is low-key flame. Bro. Hi res you're a g bro oh man this is lovely this is glorious um i think some people just don't understand why this is happening well it's happening for a number of reasons it's backfiring that people are able to see through it man too much pain and hurt and persecution on mr trump is causing people to feel sorry for him and especially men for those of us who understand how this system works, we're like, yo, man, this is not okay. And I'm not talking about from a perspective of black men. I'm saying just as a man as a whole, you get it. You get what's going on here. And this is why a lot of men are waking up. By the way, there's a final video from um, High Raz. High Raz put on a new video. <laughs> yeah, the title of this one is Donald Trump Fake News Rap Song. <laughs> Let's close this video with this one right here. Yeah, yeah. Trump the done back at it again. Shout out Big Tucker. Alex Stein, J.P. Sears, Jordan Peterson, and Ben Shapiro. They call me racist, fake news. But Kodak Mazoa got love for my Haitians. They cool. The media you're full of these federal agents. Break rules. America first, these candidates hate it. And hate you. Keep it ten toes down, stay true. Everybody, they were loving me. To the media, was switching up on me. Now they young, trying to comfort me. And get a little piece of my money. Greatest president of all time. If you think not, you're mistaken. The only president I love more is them blue hunted Ben Franklin's. These rappers are flexing their cars. Some are flexing their house. My toilet bowl is made of solid gold. I don't need gold in my mouth. Government is full of perverts. Ignoring the Hillary servers. Did Epstein really get murdered? That was my burner. Eating Trump steak, drinking Trump water. Trump towers with Trump daughter. Trump wine, I'm a super gremlin. I don't care about that loser Eminem. Trying to do me like OJ. Just know the glove that don't fit. 
It's about to be a cold case. No love for a snitch. They call me racist. Fake news. But Kodak Mazoa got love for my Haitians. They cool. The media you're full of these federal agents. Break rules. America first. These candidates hate it. And hate you. Keep it ten toes down. Stay true. Well, we're making it out of Trump Towers with this one. Oh, man. Hi, Raz. is. <laughs> By the way, I'm not sure if you guys know that the video High Raz put out of Donald Trump has not only done so well, he never expected it to do this well. 626,000 views just on YouTube alone, but over on uh, on X, things are just even, they're blowing up even more. And the other videos he's had are getting views as well. So High Raz is doing exceptionally well with the Trump music. He was number two on iTunes. I'm not sure if he's number one now, but just to say, to show you. The perspective of the people are completely changing and they're looking at what's happening to Mr. Trump and they're sympathizing not only when you speak about this matter right now and you give a good and proper perspective on it, it's getting a lot of views. I think one of the highest views that I have of any of my video in my entire YouTube life is a Donald Trump video. Let me let me show you this right here. I don't think I've, I've ever gotten this many views on any of my videos. I'm on average 2000, 10,000. I might get a 40,000 kind of guy, but the highest views I got of anything of my channel it has to do from to do, to do with Trump. And it's ridiculous. Like nothing, nothing even comes close. <laughs> I'm like, man, the, that tells you the mega base is really, really strong. They're really, really strong and they love, they love Trump. We love Trump as well because I think he is just an amazing, an amazing man. I've come to appreciate him over time. Took me a while, of course, but, um, uh, so glad I caught up to it, man, because, um, yeah, I didn't want to miss out from the amazing work I think the Lord is doing through his life. And that's why his enemies are not very happy with him. And I always tell it like it is. This morning I was reading the Bible and this is what it says, friend. Listen to this. Feel thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee, yea. I will help thee, yea. I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. Oftentimes I read this passage and I stop. But there's more to the thing. Look what it says furthermore in verse 11. Behold, all day that were incensed against thee shall be ashamed and be confounded. And what else? And be um, ashamed and confounded. And they shall be as nothing. And they that strive, that strive with thee shall perish. Thou shalt seek them, thou shalt not find them. Even them that contended with thee, they that war against thee shall be as nothing and as a thing of naught. Listen. For I, the Lord thy God, will hold thy right hand, saying unto thee, Fear not, I will help you. I love this because not only does God say, I'm going to be with you, I'm going to assist you along the way, and I'm praying this is true in the life of Mr. Trump and every single one of us as Americans. But I want to say this. The enemies, the enemies of this country, they shall be as nothing. And that's my hope and prayer as well, that they will come to nothing. We will no longer hear about them. They say, you shall seek for them. You shall not find them. Where did they go? They're gone. Where did they go? Gone. Because why? God dealt with them. <laughs> and they that war against thee shall be as nothing. I love it. Friends, pray, trust, believe, and vote. And formally, of course. <laughs> Link in the description below. Like and subscribe to the page. Click the bell icon for more support the channel as well. Share your thought and perspective with me. Let's keep the conversation going. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one. Bye.